Hey you guys, it's Megan and today was my move-in day. It's like nine o'clock or something. I need more clocks around here. Um, 9 p.m. and we have like we've we're fully done and I just sat down to relax for a little bit and kind of process the day and like just be thankful and like for my family for Richard coming to help um like just for being able to like move out to a place that is so amazing and like so homelike and like already it just feels like a really like a safe space for me and I just feel so grateful and so like proud of myself because I've put this off for so long and like part of me really doubted like when I would ever move out and like if I would ever move out and like it just kind of takes a mental toll on you um after a while and like I'm just glad that it all worked out and that I'll get to live with Alyssa and Mocha and um for the next little bit I'll be here by myself which I think is so exciting because I have never lived fully on my own. I lived with roommates in college and then moved back home. And um, so this is like my little taste of having my own place and it's a ton of work. Like literally I feel like all I've done for this whole week is just like stuff. <laughs> and um, I don't know how people do this with like kids and really like high demand high stress jobs like I've been fortunate to have a good work-life balance and I really needed it this week and it really came in handy so um I'm sitting in one of my new pieces that I got for actually my bedroom but right now I have it in our family room and this isn't like the permanent setup but um until Alyssa moves in she like has a full apartment of stuff so she'll have like a good amount of family room furniture so a lot of these pieces will eventually go downstairs into my bedroom which I'll show you guys because I haven't really been able to enjoy like what we did today um and really just like sit in in the rooms and like be like like just present I guess I was just like so go 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 all day and I um rented a u-haul which I was I really wanted to do it after um talking to my friend Zuri about it and she had done it um but <laughs> I just really didn't know how it would go like I put myself as the driver and stuff like that and it went so smoothly I would really recommend it even if you don't have like tons and tons of stuff like I was not moving everything in the U-Haul um but we filled that U-Haul with so much more than I thought that we could I just got the 10 foot which is like the smallest one that has like a like I don't know like a truck back or whatever not like a a an opening like this like you guys have no idea what I'm trying to say or maybe you do but um anyway it was the best money ever spent like it I considered getting movers but I just didn't have that much like stuff I mean I do but um we were able to do it just my family and Richard and oh, I'm just so glad it's over because I was so stressed um but now like I said, we can enjoy it. So um, I'm gonna go downstairs and show you guys my bedroom because it is pretty different from the last time you saw it. Here's a better look at the chair that I was just sitting on. I bought this off of Target's website and this is the comfiest chair I've ever sat in. It is perfect for what I wanted it for, which is reading. It has like a pretty, strong structure to it like it's very comfortable but 
it keeps you like upright, which is perfect for reading, but you can still kind of cuddle up in it because it's oversized. And it's an emerald green velvet, and it is so luxurious and nice feeling. And the price is right for like the, just everything about it, like the look, the quality, and just how sturdy it feels. Like I bought other furniture around this price point, which this was under $300, and I bought other furniture pieces recently around that price point, and they are not nearly as nice as this. So I will absolutely link this below because if you're looking for something like this, I could not recommend it higher. It was easy to assemble. It's huge and very, very comfortable. Da, 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 da. <laughs> so I have like a lot of decor and stuff that I need to deal with um, tomorrow. But here is my bed in all of its glory. I still need to put on the pillows. But um, this is the Honeycomb uh, Pottery Barn Duvet cover. I love how it looks. It's just so clean and like simple, but adds that like little bit of texture, which I love. And then the mattress and bed frame are from Amazon and I'll link those down below. Um, those were recommendations from Richard because I love his bed and so I was just like send me the links to the bed you bought and I just bought it exactly the same that he had and so tonight will be my first night sleeping on it. I barely have even sat on it but um, I know that it's that I like it from his house and then my headboard is the vintage Broyhill Brasilia um, head board and I just love how it looks and uh, it just came together so well and then I have my beloved black dresser this is a vintage refurbished piece that I bought um, from this awesome girl on Facebook marketplace I love all the details in the wood and all like the kind of swirly designs and I just love how this looks. Um, I want to put this mirror on top of it. I just haven't gotten to do that yet. And then I have this ginormous, literally ginormous um, mirror. I have always wanted a ginormous mirror for like outfit pictures and just like checking my outfit and just like, I don't know, I've always loved mirrors. And this one is massive like I'm pretty sure it's like 45 or 50 inches wide and like over six feet tall for sure and it just fit perfectly in here um it like makes my dresser look small it's crazy um and then I'm going to like put decor and stuff on here and then on this side I don't have anything yet because a lot of the stuff that will go down here is in the family room right now, so that will be a work in progress. And then this area, I'm so, so excited about. So this is going to be my Lego corner. And so I bought this um, like display case or whatever you want to call it on Facebook Marketplace. This was my very first thing I bought for the new house. And um, I just love it because I'll be able to display so many different Lego builds here. Um, so I'm gonna do that. And then on this wall, I'm gonna put the um, Lego puzzle that me and Rachel did. I'm gonna put that like right there. And then this desk was my work desk and vanity in my bedroom at my parents' house for years. And I realized it would be perfect here as like a display because I have like two shelves there. I could use it as like a display on the top, but I could also use it as an in progress, like Lego build station. So this corner is just gonna be all Lego. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, and then this corner is gonna have my bookcases. Oh my gosh, it's just gonna be amazing. My office and beauty room is a wreck, <laughs> but I have, a lot more stuff in here than I did the other day. Um, and I can't wait to put all my makeup and beauty products in this gorgeous piece. This is a vintage mid-century modern dresser and I love it. I love it so much. We picked this up today from the antique store and I just love this 
piece so much. I love the hardware. It's like so funky and just really cool. And the drawers are huge. I'm pretty sure this is about two feet wide or something. It might be even more. Um, yeah, I think it's 30 inches wide. I have so much space in here to spread out my products. So I'm thinking and hoping my entire makeup collection will fit in this top drawer. But if not, I have a second drawer that's the same um, like depth. And then the other drawers are slightly deeper. And I'm planning to put um, like the rest of my beauty products, skincare, Bath and Body Works, etc. Um, because I don't have a lot of storage in the bathroom like I did at home. So I did start to <laughs> get all my perfumes out the other day. But as you can see, I have a lot of other things that I need to deal with. So this is kind of the current status of my beauty room and office. But <laughs> I'm just so excited to fill this baby up. I literally can't stop, won't stop today. It doesn't help that I don't have like clocks anywhere. Um, but after I got like ready for bed, I realized it was only 9.30 and I was like, I feel like I have time to do more things. So um, my bed's kind of a mess, but um, I set up these tables, which I might keep as my bedside table. I'm not sure. I love how it looks. Um, but it would be convenient, of course, to have like drawers or a drawer at the bedside. But I have these um, lamps that I got from um, Target. They were only $10. I still cannot believe that with the shade. And the marble um, coasters, those are from Target. And the cups. Um, those are from Home Goods. I just love it. And then I have a few things down there. And then I've been working on that. Oh my god, I can't wait to show you that. But this one just has, like, nothing really right now. But I've always wanted, like, side tables. I'm so excited. Uh, um, and this is what I'm most excited about. Please excuse my parents. Um, <laughs> but I have been dying to, like, set up this dresser and like put decor on it and stuff so i have this big um like more farmhouse style mirror from target pretty much everything is from target um, that's what you'll discover about my decor and then i have these like pink fluffy pompous grass stems from target um i love this white ceramic vase it is amazing and then this like more bronzy like squat <laughs> round vase and then um, when I was organizing my perfumes I separated out perfumes that I really only wear for bed and then the Billie Eilish perfume because I really just got it for the bottle I just think it is so beautiful and I just love it so I put these perfumes on a tray that I've had for a million years, also from Target, but very, very old. And then I love this lamp. So I got both pieces at Target, um, but this base, like, it's not online, so I don't know if you just have to get lucky in store to find it, but it is like, I don't know, it looks like so cool to me it's like resin or something I can't like explain this lamp I just love the texture and then I love the rectangular um shade on it I just think that looks so cool that juxtaposition and I bought the base and the shade separately and just put those together um so that is my dresser set up right now I'm so excited and then I have my jewelry box that I can't wait to display and I'm getting a smaller dresser to put there and if it doesn't fit there I'm putting it in this corner I really really hope it fits over here though because then that would be kind of like my whole vibe of this area um but yeah I have to pick that up tomorrow that's from like a Facebook seller so I think that's all I'm gonna do tonight. I literally 
got like a second or third or fourth wind um but i'm just gonna need to like settle and get ready like to sleep because Alyssa's family is coming tomorrow with some stuff for her um like she's coming and her family's coming to move in some things um so I, I just need to get some rest I haven't slept well for the past week just with like all the things going on and now I feel like okay my room is more set up I have light uh, and all of that and my camera doesn't seem to want to focus anymore I don't know why but anyhow I'm gonna go to bed and I'll see you tomorrow morning you guys or should I say afternoon I think it's like 1 30 already um oh my gosh I look so bad um I have been running around like a crazy woman today. I went to try to go pick up my like thing from Facebook Marketplace, like a seller from Facebook Marketplace, but she didn't answer the door. So I don't know, but I guess I'm gonna have to go back out. But I did get my nightstand from Target. So I took up the one, um, like black side table and I put that in our family room for now but I just love this piece it's like the perfect height great color and I could get it um already fully assembled because it was like the display and the drawer is perfect like I can even put a box of tissues in there and then I have like a little um shelf down there I could either put nothing or a book or like something um and i got two of these clocks from target that um i got one for down here and one for in my office and i just really like it and i don't like clocks that have the numbers light up <laughs> because i'm really sensitive to light um when i'm sleeping but you can just press it down and it lights up if you want to see it in the middle of the night but um, Alyssa and her family are coming to drop off like a load of stuff so I've just been frantically running around upstairs like clearing everything out because I don't want them to be like overwhelmed the second they get here um, so I tidied up all of like our common spaces and yeah so now I'm really out of breath and um, basically I just need to do what I can um, until they get here. I didn't want to get like super involved in anything because I don't know if they'll need my help or not. But yeah, my room is still a mess over here, but it is what it is. I thought it would be actually more disastrous than this, but um, for my nightstands, I'm getting another one to put on this side and then I'll have those black, um, tables as like side tables which will be great and I love my dresser setup I have some crap that I have to deal with but um yeah all in all things are slowly but surely coming together oh my gosh you guys I have not seen you in hours oh my gosh I'm finally ready for bed I cannot wait to fall asleep oh my gosh I'm never gonna be like bored or have free time again i swear oh my gosh i just wish i could like read like that is like so just amazing sounding to me right now but like i have no time to do anything but house stuff um which is very fun and i'm loving it but it is truly exhausting and even though i feel like i did so much today it doesn't look like I made a lot of progress and that's like really disheartening but I know it's just the way it is um it's just one of those things so I showered here for the first time and it was wonderful um I did like a scrub I just really enjoyed like pampering myself because it was, it's been a long time since I like took a like nice hot just like relaxing shower because I have just been like so go 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 you know um but I got this piece today um this small dresser 
from a Facebook Marketplace seller and I love it. I love the hardware that she put on it. It's like these, I don't know what kind of shape that is, but it has like the faux marble um, look with the gold, which is one of my like vibes. I just love gold and marble. And this um, and my other dresser, those are like the main places I'll be storing my clothing. So I wanted a second piece just in case I needed like additional storage because you can't ever have too much. So just for right now, I have this lamp from home. I think I'm going to keep that there and I need to rearrange my beautiful Ann and Joseph jewelry. It got all like shuffled in the move um but i'm really happy with this piece and glad that i got that so today was just kind of like a lot of running around i was filming a lot but just not for the vlog i um am in the process of like organizing and just d like war zoning my <laughs> office and beauty room because it has been just like a dumping ground and I just really need to get that room sorted out so I feel like I did a lot in there today but it still looks horrible because I need to put a lot of stuff still away and I'm trying to find a place for everything because that was always my problem before and why I would have like a lot of clutter was that one I was bringing in things I shouldn't um, and I didn't have a space to put whatever it was um, so now I'm like I only want to bring things in that I have like a space for and so right now I'm trying to find that spot for everything that I currently have and that of course just takes time so um, the areas that I've done I really like but it's just kind of an exhausting process and I can't wait to sleep, but I'm depressed that tomorrow's Monday and I just wish I could take off like a month and just like focus on the house because I love it. Like it is so rewarding and just like a really like special thing to just be able to do what I want in my space and not have to worry about like anyone else. Um, of course in our shared spaces that's a different story but like in my bedroom and my office and my bathroom like I can just do whatever I want so I love that. But I'm going to wrap up the vlog here. Let me know how you guys are doing. I would love to know what you guys are up to and um I will definitely keep you posted on more house updates. I feel like I'm definitely going to be vlogging more often than normal. Um, so that'll be fun for you guys to have some additional videos. But yeah, so I really appreciate you guys watching as always. And I'll see you soon. Bye.